Hi, it's Andrea Callanan. Welcome to my channel. Thanks for coming on to this episode. Today, I want to talk to you about something that's incredibly important in my life, probably one of the biggest drivers in my life, and that's music. It's an amazing game changer in terms of your state. So I use music on a daily basis to change my state, to get myself into gear uh, so that I can be in a place of servitude for my team. Uh, if I've got up and my toddler has been awake all night or I've just got up on the wrong side of the bed, the way I change my state will often be with music. I'm a musician, as some of you may know, uh, so I began life as a classical musician. I trained as an opera singer. Uh, the voice has pretty much powered how I spend my time and how I make my money throughout the whole of my life. Uh, it's so crucial to me that music is around and that music is in my children's lives and in my contemporaries' lives. So the people in my community who I resonate with most, usually they have a love of music. They're either practitioners themselves, they're musicians, they're singers, they're writers, they're composers, or they're just people who really love and devour music. So here are some ways in which you can do more with music in your life. The first thing I would, I would obviously suggest is that you listen to music. Music is a universal language that is used. It breaks so many barriers across the world. It breaks barriers across cultures, across religion, across race, um, across gender. Music is just amazing. So get involved with music. The second thing I would encourage you to do is make some music. You don't have to be a musician to make music. You don't have to be somebody who can read music or who's got good rhythm or who can sing or who can play an instrument. You just need to be somebody who enjoys it. So get yourself along to a community choir, get yourself along to a community samba group, go and see a concert, go and see a gig, go to a performance, even if it's your child in a school performance, go to a performance and experience the energy of live music, whether you're doing it yourself, whether you're, you're sat in the energy of that, but just get yourself involved with some live music. And then the third thing that I would suggest you do is encourage others to partake in music. For all of the reasons that I've listed already in today's vlog, I really want you to use music as a communicative tool between you and the, and the relationships that you hold dear. If you want to get involved more with music, there are a myriad of musical organisations in your communities, I can guarantee it. If you want to get more involved with music through us, then please get in touch with us and look out for any of the day courses that we'll be offering. Look out for a super choir near you. Super choirs will be launched across the UK and beyond uh, in 2017 and 18. And if you want to improve your vocal skills, we've got a myriad of voice teachers. We've got loads of um, piano teachers. We've got piano days that you can get involved with. We've got composers who can talk to you about how to structure songs and how to write songs. And there are gigs galore that you can get involved with. So just get in touch with us, um, engage with music. Your life is here to be experienced and enriched. And music is one of the gifts that we have which can do that.